The role of the software architect is becoming increasingly important as systems get more complex. The ICQB Certified Professional for Software Architecture is a globally recognized education and training program that enables software architects to perform successfully. The title Software Architect encompasses many things such as leading, designing, client-facing and doing a technical role. At the foundation certification level, you will demonstrate that you are able to independently create and document the architecture of a system, as well as assure and evaluate its quality. To be certified, you must pass the ICQB Software Architecture Foundation Level exam. You can prepare for it by attending a training course with a recognized ICQB training provider. Participants will have relevant content and topics clearly explained and taught to them. To find out more about content of training and examination, please visit our website iski.org and download the syllabus or take a mock exam and experience the real flex examination environment. Upon completing a course and certification, you are well versed in explaining the behavior of a system and understanding the components, connections, protocols, topologies and other key areas needed in the job. The role of a software architect is among the highest in demand in the software industry. It is no secret that one of the highest paying jobs in software ecosystem is software architect. Certification as CPSA Foundation is a valuable seal of approval for a globally recognized training standard in software architecture. It offers many advantages for professional development. Gaining certification builds your credentials and reflects that you have the necessary skills to perform your job. As a follow-on to the foundation level, the CPSA advanced level is the next logical step in qualifying software architecture professionals. Developed according to the ICQB's specification, this training scheme follows a modular structure and requires successful participants to demonstrate comprehensive knowledge and skills. In order to take the CPSA Advanced Level exam, you need the CPSA Foundation Level certification. In addition, you will need at least three years of professional experience in the IT industry including participation in design and development of at least two different IT systems, as well as participation in a licensed training course totaling at least 70 credit points from all three different competence areas, methodology, technology and communication. So, to conclude, the role of a software architect is worth the effort that goes into achieving it. It is a growth-oriented role with scope for further development. Do not hesitate, it is right time to start preparing for becoming a certified software architect and to be picked by a leading organization. <music>